So, welcome to the scrapbook. This is the real John King. Back at it again. I was bored today, so I figured I'd do a little uh, scrapbook share here with y'all. Um, I'm um, I'm trying to keep it in some kind of order to where it makes sense, man. But anyhow, this is my first. Promo photo, promotional photo. This picture cracks me up, man, because um, I didn't know nothing about promo material, photos. I didn't even know at the time that if you black, you went to a black photographer. And if you white, you go to a white photographer. I just found a photographer in the phone book and went and um, had my photo taken. Took it to this place that would put the um, uh, name at the bottom of the picture, which I didn't know how all that stuff worked. But anyhow, the reason why I'm bringing this all up is because uh, my complexion is not that dark. Now, I was staying in Alabama at the time, and the sun is like intense down there, man. So I, I did tan quite a bit, probably three shades darker than I normally am. But um, this picture is probably four shades darker than I normally am, maybe even five, because uh, photographers that don't do black people, they're not set up to do black people. So I think their cameras are set a little bit darker, so when they photograph Caucasian, you know, they don't white out on the shot, that they got, you know, some kind of, you know, color to them, so they'll show up. Well, in my case, I came out extra dark, and then, too, when I took the picture to get the um, name put on it, they have to reshoot the picture. And, you know, because they have to put the lettering on it and they reshoot it with the lettering put down, with the name put down there on it, which darkened the picture up even more. So that's why that's real funny to me, man, because I'm not that dark, but I was extra dark on my photo on this promotional shot. And... Uh, <laughs> I got this big wide smile, man, because I was happy as hell to get my first promotional photo shot. I got the big ass gap in my teeth. But at that point, man, I would I didn't really give a shit. I actually went to a dentist to try to get my gap filled. And the dentist said, Well, man, I don't grind down perfectly um, you know, teeth that are perfect. He said, if you had some issue or some flaw, I would like, you know, I would uh cap them you know i could close the gap that way and i didn't know no better man so i just said okay so <laughs> so i still got my big ass gap man but at this point in my life man i don't give a shit about no gap you know uh getting a gap fixed at this point ain't gonna help me out none i just want to uh, uh make sure my health is good i ain't i ain't really tripping about no gap in no teeth i didn't had it all my life so i don't give a shit about it at this point well, anyhow, I just thought I would share that with y'all, man. My first promotional photo. Let me get a close-up here. Real John King's cheesing like hell, man. <laughs> Look like I just got out of damn straight off the plane from South Africa, man. Dark as hell, but that's all right. That's what it was, and and uh, I'm just glad I kept those memories. Take care. This video too long, but take care, man. Bye.